Well, look, I'm all geared up for some chaos as it looks to be a bit of a B site right from FaZe Clan. It's a classic, and let's see what Lecro can get done in the meanwhile. Not a Deagle in his hands, but I'm sure he's still good for a few as a flashbang comes out from Nico, and that's blinded up his own teammates. AZ's come up with two more kills, and the only one to survive is Nico himself. And as he rotates back towards the A site, he needs to be able to take down Cajun as he'll cross past. The knife to the wall will reveal his position. Cajun will be waiting for his teammates, actually. Might just let the bomb plant come through and Nico's got this in a moment of safety. Cajun's been oh. boosted up. Nico will take the duel and Gade will win it as he comes in from short. Mm. AKs, they're out. Fast forward, oh, long they go. No. Oh, range oh, fully no. flashed and it's a one for one exchange. Brokey even looking for more, but it's a labored spray. Cajun finding kills, but the Deegs answer back. In accumulation, at least from the North B site players. But now, keep an eye on Lecro. He'll want to be beaking oh. out. What a shot down mid Lecro. <laughs> Kirby has decided to split up from his teammate as well. Kirby will be finding the back of Lecro and leaves AZ alone in a one on two. See what damage he can find. Not really enough time to actually get the bomb defused. And AZ will now lead up, gets a lot of damage onto Kirby as well, and will guarantee the death of the terrorist side player. But at the end of the day, it is a lost round. A lost off it's a double bluff potentially rain trying to find anything on the rotations but nico still finding frags on the a site msl down but gade alive and kicking that long presence it's gone so gades are now isolated on the site three terrorists coming his way he's trying to fight for any sort of control back himself out of the situation but he's caught with a nade out rain catching the timing and lecro holding the cross but not getting anything from it perfectly positioned to stop the kid from coming anywhere close brokey Will land the shot, and that's already finished off the round. Lecro knows he needs to back off or fight his way out. Either one of those is going to be so difficult when Broke is still on top of the site. And I'm hoping, praying for for North, not to let what happened to G2 happen to them. So far, so good. Some good damage accomplished, even in a low buy round, and they're all tagged down severely here on phase. At oh, Cajun catching a glimpse through the door, spams Nico down. And that's a big advantage of fine when Brokey and Rain are low in range of MSL. Brokey drop down from immediately. Gay doesn't want to contest. Cajun waits and sees him coming around the corner. Good oh. for one and good for two. Picks up the AK as well. Smokes it off and that gives him some space to reposition. Brokey's only got an AWP and Rain has fallen already. Back down to a four versus one. Where North were forced by it out, it seems like their own half by is what will net them the victory. Now they're going up short quickly. Gade will have to try and defend. And as he hovers around with the AUG, Reigns move past him. Gade has been taken down, but not before he can get one. The B bomb side players can't walk up mid, though. They have to come through CT as the smoke is buying so much time and a one way at that. Rain almost finds one, but as he's bunny hopping around, Cajun will take him down. Now Broki to fall. Cajun doing it all. AZ is being taken down. Nico from behind and Cole Zero on the lurk. It's all Cajun it's all day, though. Them. And he's got the defuse down to a right and can he get another kill while he fades away no but he's got the round nonetheless brokey is forced back and cool zero will be taking the 1v1 cajun no flash right now but he saw the boo he saw the foot of cold and north do very well when they have all of their pieces when they can work on these crossfires but is he getting caught with the smoke out that doesn't seem like a part of the plan Time and time again, Lecro has been left alone on the B-bomb side, but this Ooh. time it's Nico to intercept Gade. MSL, that's how it's done through a flashbang. Lecro will fall, but not before he gets one kill of his own. Unfortunately, that might not be enough, and with MSL and Cajun posturing to save these weapons, the question is, can he find that initial pickoff as a flashbang will come through? What? <laughs> Rain? <laughs> That is unreasonable, Rain, as he'll walk out, look for more, can't quite get the spray initially, but he'll get it done at the end of the day, and that's what matters. Two kills to open it up, and Cajun, he's trying to return fire. Some crisp shots, yes, but he's also been tagged and bagged. Cool Zera to deliver a swift death, leaving just Lecro and AZ. And again, you're starting to think, do you just save if you're north, and what are you saving towards? Rounds are not going the way they'd like them to. AZ will not land a shot, and what is going on here? There has to be recognition. Okay, the orders are out. Of course, they have money to spare. Raid catches them on the cross. It's tags galore. Lecker getting gunned down. They'll have a shadow advantage as well for this fight. The flash, they read into it. But Cole what? switches away. He thought he 
thought he killed him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Expected hey, hey. chaos. <laughs> Look at the hole in through middle. Oh. Nico finds one. It's a quick trade from Gabe. But the B side is open. Okay. So, there are things happening on this map that not everyone knows about, but MSL will try to make some sense of the situation as he comes in and in the chaos will find another one. Kirby knows it'll be all up to him. Flashbang overhead, Kirby's blind, MSL will get the kill initially, and he's doing it all on his own, but Brokey's doing the same. Oh. Gets the no-scope through the wall. Quickly, first smoke down towards CT. The flash is there, and Rain blinded up, so he's allowing the cross. But the second, it doesn't do anything. AZ down, oh. Rain's good on the pistol. He gets two, and Nico reinforces for an additional. Cajun's been so good so far, but can he do four over here? Because Gay's been tagged down to oh. nothing. The nade to finish him off, and Cajun oh. is only good for damage. They are not going to show anything until they're ready to walk up. And now that the smokes have gone out, Nico's going to be forced to take point. What an interesting smoke thrown forward over the elevator. Nico will get initial kill anyway, but he's traded away soon. Cajun, as he starts to lead up, Rain will be... Looking to come up ramp. He's been very good on the position so far. Now will be no different. Lecro fighting back with the Galil. Cuts his head off Ooh. right and goes for a second. There's a third waiting, but Cole Zera is looking to fight back. A 1v2 where he just can't get it done. But MSL's angle is so difficult to actually deal with as smokes go out. And MSL's got the shot. Rain will reposition, try to get some damage done. Smoke out is good as well, but he needs to fight them off as there's a player coming up from ramp soon enough. Rain knows it, and as he gets distracted by the jump, being clear, it's already Lekro who's crept fast and taking out Kirby. Uh -oh. Rain's being burnt down and will fall. AC circles around and North. What an execution of that A site. North is setting up for another long side take. Ooh. Well, it might be broken pretty soon though. Rain. Good flashbang out, keeps him at bay for now. And as he peeks forward, he will scout one. Very sloppy spray, but he's found the bomb as well at the back of it. While Nico's good for another. Pulls out the grenade and he knows it's a mistake. Rain has corrected it for him. AZ left alone, one versus five. And he will find some damage. Ooh. Two quick kills, gives him a chance to... Kirby on the up. Find that kill and then we're talking. Unfortunately, Rain will just peek right out. Yeah. It does lead you to believe that the protocols will start getting ironed out a little too quickly on the <laughs> by AZ. Quick towards long. Kirby had absolutely no idea. Well, Nico does, and he's taking him down. Looking for more, but with a second player jumping down to pit, Lekros found himself chaos to exploit. Up from short, he's lurked in for two quick kills. And now with just two players left on FaZe Clan, they will have to turn around. And Nico, who's scoped directly in, can just flash for rain in this position. Smokes go out. Rain's been smoked off. Nico's gonna have to flash soon. And indeed, it comes in from Brokey instead. Cole has found the first Lekro to fall, but gain an AZ response. Cole still fighting for B control as he gets another one, but he's already lost his teammate Brokey. Molotov goes close. It'll be forcing him back and with a smoke right next to it. Cole's got no chance of actually getting in and preventing this bomb from being planted. 3v3. A flash primed for Cold, sailing through. Now Cajun turns from an MSL, the instant trade, the back and forth. Cold left in the clutch, 12 HP, MSL around the box, trying to flush him out to the opening. Cold comes out firing, but it's MSL that survives on nine HP. They start trying to gamble stack, trying to push for an early rotation. Questions to be answered perhaps later. Deagle's out, Rain, the first to find a kill, but MSL and AZ. You take short right back. Ooh, okay. Brokey, scout in hand. Quick little headshot. We've seen a lot of scout headshots and another one to follow. Nico. And now cold with Dan Deagle ready. Might just go unclear. Molotov does find him and force him back. So MSL knows he has just enough time to get the bomb down. But Nico and Cold are still creeping oh. through. Cold's got one and looks for two. Gabe now has to defend and save today all on his own. He's found the first, but he's expecting Nico to be on a different angle. Nico's got the AK, so a quick tap could come through. And indeed it does, Nico. Mixed bag so far. Oh. Brokey all 
fast play that Nate does so much damage. It's weakened opponents for Cold, and he's lining them up and knocking them down. Three kills for Cold. It's been spectacular so far on the B hole. And he goes further. He tries to push past the Molotov. So low are these North players. And the flash. Oh no, it hits Raid as well. So it's still a two on two knows that there is still the risk as he re-smokes off the doors and he will be planting for a much safer position nico is aware and gade still directly zoned in he's got the first and this time he's not going to drop the ball cajun's right with him well it did break in the middle but apparently they fixed it and they're using the same thing all over again rain a slightly more awkward angle they're not expecting this gets one gets two and he's got the chance for more but gate and easy can spray him down through the plywood brokey now has to try and replicate that as some damage is dealt and leaves gate softened up for the kill gate gets the bomb blown in but brokey has got the shot msl to fall gate and cajun once again in a very tricky spot as brokey looks to find another does flick oh. and does get it gate who is weakened already is brought down cajun in a 1v3 so many deagles to deal with and he does get away for now still fighting away 32 hp a shot away from death and nico with the awp is going to be safeguarding this bomb refuse cajun will peek out soon enough needs to get the kill and he does oh. do so backs off as well cajun's doing it all on his lonesome that's it and he's got the round 29 kills for the man himself as well necro has just been left to lurk though and they're going for short control necro's found the first trade is there from the cts isolated duels with multi kills and can they get that job done oh. Solid day timing there for Brokey. They've been weakened up on this B side hit. There's come in for Nico. There's time for the rotation, but they're getting caught off by MSL. He lurked with the AWP and he caught two. So it's Kierby in a clutch that he's not even going to attempt. Very nice to have, but Kierby's getting out. He's going to peek out soon. There's a shadow there. Kierby's only good for one. And with that. Over to the A side they go, 48 seconds on the clock and right around the corner is Rain. He's waiting for them to peek out. Rain will have the flash to assist, goes forward, AZ to fall. And North, they're still trying to prevent overtime. Nico's missed the shot, a rare happenstance, but it will come through. A second Rain Molotov as well, forces him into the open and Gade will be the one to take him down. While well, MSL finds the back lines, but the back lines are filled with Cole Zera. Lepro fighting back, the headshot angle too strong. MSL left alone in a one versus is one and he's caught out mid-air face takes it over time and we've got to take a breather therapist to seek out what's going wrong hopefully they figured it out though face clan have lost themselves and still some warnings being given in through middle over towards b they go and bro he takes the fight so much damage it's lecker one hp Come on, MSL. You know you want to creep forward. Nico's right in front of you. Will get the kill as well. And you can see FaZe immediately have to turn around, flash in mid, retake it. And MSL's already run away. FaZe will be forced to save. This is a reminder to anyone who's tuning in. This is not 16k overtime. This is $10,000 only. You've got to save your weapons if you're on the CT side and you're losing your first round. Yeah, especially if you're investing into the AWP, it strains it even further. So good that they get their hands back on. North up to 16. Not when they'd like to have been, but Nico, he is up catwalk to find some information and find some progress as Lecro is taken down. The trade is late. And although he takes some damage, he's not going to take the fall. We'll drop down back towards the A side. Kirby's good for one as well. 32 kills on him. Really making up for the perhaps strategic issues that have popped up occasionally but he's been burnt down and then easy will finish him off kirby good for the trade and when you're five versus three that's all you really need yep just keep going forward gets a nice spray down can't finish it off though it's a riskier shot but he pulls it off over towards B they go, the mall top, they run through the smoke and Brokey lines up two easy kills. So much damage on MSL as well and Cold still alive on the side. These flashes have done nothing. The nade sails in, they've called the, the rotations and they're here on time. MSL, 10 HP, no bomb, the AWP, yeah, the round gone. It's a call that doesn't make sense because we've seen so many times over throughout the entire game as we will see MSL find the initial kill, very important for them to get. Every single time I told that Todd Nico's gone through mid and found himself to trade immediately. 
There's a lot of players set up towards the B bomb side, and with the Molot uh, with the smoke and a Molotov down towards the mid B area, this will be a big round for Lekro potentially. Good nade, and he's trying to follow through. Gets Ooh. one and two. Spray trunks is perfect, and his aim is as well. Makes it three, leaving Brokey alone versus the same amount. The smoke coming out. They can lurk forward. They will do so as well. MSL moves backwards. Car will get this. What? Oh, oh, cute play. Okay, that's aggressive from Rain. It's uh, gonna be a play towards B. They had Kier B lurking in the tunnel all round long, and they drop and they find kills in spades. This B bomb site heavily under pressure, and Lecro flushed out the back plat. Cajun, you've had a good game so far. A one versus five, not too likely, and he's been spotted as well. Just caught a glimpse of him on the rotation. Nico makes it a flawless. Question is. Can they actually get a kill initially? Yes, they oh can. Come on, God. guys. Come on. Make arguments against 16K, but he does it in 10K as well. Gade will now peek out Brokey to detect him. He knows that there needs to be some aggression. There's still hope, but he needs to find two, three, four kills, and he's not good for even one. Lecro left alone versus five, and he will go down. Face Clan will be the victors of the first map.